Hello folks and welcome back to the Vertigo Tea Party and Let's Play Dishonored 2. Today's episode is brought to you by Gage. Thank you very much Gage for your continued support on the Patreon. I very much appreciate it. So we're continuing re-checking uh, out the uh, mansion here. We're going to try to make this, you know, semi-quick. Guys, relax, relax, relax. Just want to go in here. Look, Spittles. At least I'm not one of them. Exactly. And think, when all this fighting of the thrones is settled, the Duke's going to need men to take charge in the Northern Isles. By this time next year, you could be in charge of Windown or Freeport. Where even the most desirable have skin like pale slugs. That's what the brandy's for. Tuh. What do we get in here? I don't think they're coming over here, but I want to quickly get in here before they decide that they want to. All right, let's go relatively quickly here. Not going to rush per se. Uh, and again, most of this exploration will be done, well, not offline, but um, I'll probably check around offline a few times more than usual to make sure I've got everything, blah, blah, blah. And there's two rune, or uh, Bone charms we still need. Guy over there. Let's try this. I, I want to. Let's see just how well this ends up working. Ha ha ha! Nice. Yeah, because I think uh, I think that would have probably normally been heard because he did scream. So I had considered changing it out. I had considered changing out that rune. No, that's my own damn footsteps. God damn it. Wait. No, it's not. Unless I'm still walking and just don't realize it. But yeah, that's entirely possible. I've been confused by myself a few times. But yeah, he did scream. But oh, I was, was going to say, um, I'd consider changing it. Changing that rune out. Just because we are so rarely oh, use it. Oh. Ow! God damn it. I'm <laughs> reload that. I was trying to grab him. I should have actually tested it. Especially since he's sitting right in the middle of a bunch of bottles. That was my, my dumb bad. My dumb. Let's just call it my dumb. Doing a dumb thing. It'll be the only one I've ever done since I started my YouTube channel, which is fairly impressive. You gotta admit. Somebody sitting on the stairs. We can actually maybe sneak up on this guy. She had her silver embroidered jacket made. No one knows what's happening. Could be anything. Vassal just got shot my own. Close enough. He didn't uh, alert, so that's fine. Again, not that it matters. He'd got a ton of alerts already, but still, I don't want to be super sloppy and just keep getting alerts. I had thought about doing one mission where we just run in and say, like, F it all. Just run in swinging. I think that actually could be a fun run. Yeah, it's terrible. Oh shit. <laughs> God, that's awesome. Last time I had a day off was in the month of ice. I'm long overdue for a day to myself to do whatever I want. They said there could be someone about. Could be some sort of madman or cutthroat or pickpocket. Just my luck. That was a guard, so it was okay. At least I think it was. Where's that person? They sound like right up in us. Right up in our anus. Or to be fair, they could be in our vajayjays. We gotta be careful because they can see us through the window there. Marvelous. 
prime game if you are. There's, nope, that's a statue. Kit <laughs> Piss and Cracker is my favorite game. Day at the Botanical Gardens. Whoa, wow. Ma'am, please, it's a, a friendly game. Jesus Christ. Yes. Uh. <laughs> God damn. That's a friendly game, Meredith. Okay, why not? Gerald, it'll be a fun, good time. Like five minutes later, take that, you fucking dog, fucking piece of shit. Your mother's a whore. It's like, whoa. See, this is why nobody plays with you. Uh, whoops. Did she really fall that far that it killed her? Oh, come on now. That's like... Uh, Emily's probably five and a half-ish. If you go with the standard, that's like a six-foot wall. Let's try that again. Obviously, we could just sleep dart their asses, which we might end up having to do. In fact, I'll probably go ahead and just do that because it's faster. But man, that uh, that grab thing, there is so many awesome things we could use that for. I wish I'd have got it sooner. I wish I'd have grabbed it sooner. Uh huh? Yeah, I know. This is why I'm the best YouTuber, by the way. No, no. Fucking, I can't help myself. I gotta try it again. That, you dog fucker. <laughs> God damn it. Whoa! So, if I knock one of them unconscious, that's interesting. I think that's probably a bug. Because he definitely got up. Right? Like, he got, he got up. And I was kind of thinking about that, too. I was like, well, it takes you a while to choke somebody out. And technically, since they're linked, he should be being choked out at the same time. But I didn't think that would happen. Uh, but it looks like if you choke them out while they're linked like that, after the grab, they disappear. That's really weird. Take that. Unless, uh, nope, okay. I thought maybe there's something special about these two. Like, maybe they're, uh... I mean, other than, you know, the fact that they're people with their own lives and personalities and all that stupid bullshit. Maybe there was something special about them, like they were outsiders or uh, witches in disguise or some shit. But I don't think that's the case. Anyway, let me uh, hide these two bodies and we'll continue searching. All right. I uh, dealt with the bodies. And again, I mean, they're not, I don't want to call them bodies. I mean, it sounds like they're dead. They're definitely not dead. And I'm not saying that in the, like, they're definitely not dead, wink, wink kind of way. I mean, like, they're totally definitely not dead. Duke's quarters. Okay, this is just a general, like, hey, the Duke's an asshole. I've noticed, too, like, when you reload the game, anytime you mission, get a mission clue, it, like, tells you again, like, hey, this is really interesting. This is the first time you've heard this information, even when it's necessarily not this the first time you've heard it. But this is the crappiest maze ever. It's like, oh, geez, I can't figure out where to go. It's like, when you can see over the hedge, I feel like it kind of defeats the purpose of the, uh, of the thing. Oh, hello. Um, I did not do this. And again, this is not the hello, LOL, wink, wink, I did not do this thing. Oh. I literally didn't do it. What? I can't have evidence that I killed the maid. Because people will assume that I killed the maid. That's why. Because you said, oh, why would people think you did that? Well, of course they're going to think I did it. I did everything else. I mean, I did some of the things. What's up with that anyway? Like, that's very interesting that some random workers are dead. Oh, hello. Why is it so quiet? Listen, you can't hear it. That's really bizarre. I feel like I should be able to hear that. Uh, obviously, we're not going to do anything with alarm because there's pretty much nobody left to pull the alarm, I say, as weird noises are made. By the way, there definitely is somebody above. I turned on my vision once and I was able to see it. 
Ooh, can I grab the, uh... Nice. Oh, and I automatically looted that one. Nice. All right, what is that one? Something sickness? Relocation sickness, which is sometimes stumble off balance after magical relocation. Eh. That seems interesting, mildly. The problem is we hardly ever see those witches, which is a shame. No, no pun intended. God damn it. Uh, again, how did these people get here? Maybe they got... No, the Ark would have dissipated their bodies into many pieces. Uh, let's... Don't you do it. Don't you do it, you son of a bitch. Uh, there's no point in uh, reprogramming that one. There's no fun to be had there, I'm afraid. I was like, oh my god, where did that bone charm go? Yep. My brain functions as intended. Okay, unconscious. Uh, he looks like he's... Oh, no, no, no. He is quite dead. I was like, man, he's sure bleeding a lot for being unconscious. Well, again, don't want any uh, evidence of my foul play when I didn't even kill the guy. Like, I'll take credit for the people I killed. Or maybe even the robots that I reprogrammed that happened to kill some innocent people. Ah, satisfying for some bizarre reason. I think I was a pirate captain in my past life because I really love throwing people into the sea. Get into the sea. Careful, that's a death threat these days. All right, quick look around. Do I see anything hiding behind there? Got some lights. Those are just lights. Oddly enough. It's a shame that there's no guards left because I would love... Oh, you know what? I could take that explosion explosive and take out the uh, robot guy. The one that's over there by the vault. Like the vault exit that we never did take out. We can take him out. All right, so it looks like we've been here because we found a random pouch. So I'm going to keep looking. Pick you guys up when I find some new area. All right, so I searched everywhere outside pretty much. Uh, but I, there's like one thing I thought I wanted to show you guys, but now I don't remember it. So, oh well. But I don't think it was anything important. Uh, however... There is a robot over here. Boosh! Oh good, that blew his head up. Also, before I was messing with him, and I found a nifty little trick that may or may not be useful to you. And probably not. If you... Do this... <clears throat> if you do... This... Hello. Alright, so... Wait, whoa. Uh, there we go. I just kept spamming left kick. But what I was trying to show you, and obviously I did not do a very good job of, is that sometimes when you do the, the pull, you actually can, uh, if you either A, left click at the correct time, or B, just spam left click, uh, you can actually do the uh, insta-kill or... That noise. We turn that off. I don't know what that is. Uh, anyway, you can actually do the insta-kill thing. Well, not insta-kill, because you have to do it twice, right? You gotta kill the head once, and then you have to do it again for the very first time. All right, so that's obviously the goal, which is obviously not where we're going. Let's go see if we can find this. So yeah, this big dome is this area, which I, you know, should have realized pretty easily. I don't like shit making noise in here. It's not like that weird looking bony ass version of uh, Mr. Uh, Mr. Man isn't creepy enough. Where is this thing? I've probably passed by it like a dozen times. And there's still at least one person roaming around. I'm pretty sure they are just a civilian. Ah, we have not been in here. It looks like the Red Room from uh, Twin Peaks. Twin Peaks is a funny show. I, I, get, I love Twin Peaks. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. All right, let's let's do a little test here. Whatever you need, I can't help you. Be on your way now. I can't Wait. do anything for you. 
What the hell? God damn it. Nope. Well, let's see what happens. Okay. They didn't die that time. But wait, what? She also wasn't linked. What the hell? What the hell's going on here? Explain yourself. Oops. Well, maybe she won't be doing that. So, like, you guys had a body in here, and you run out here like, Hey, man, get a body! Like, you've never seen a body. You got one in there, you made a body. Uh, apparently, you're worshipping the bone charm, which you goddamn primitives don't realize you're just supposed to put it around your necklace. Or put it around your necklace? Yes, make a necklace out of it and wear it around like a normal person and get superpowers. Jesus Christ. All right. Let's try that again. I wonder why that one time that ends up happening. That's really weird. Let's have some fun with the old stun grenade. We haven't used that one for a while. Oh yeah, that was a little bit delayed. All right, so they don't aggro. Kind of a pisser. All right, we're gonna try this again. You kids getting high in here? So. But, what? Okay, that's just flat out bugged. Like, there's no way that's supposed to happen that way. That's freaking weird. All right, we're, we're gonna do them. We're gonna do them normal. Also, I like how they're on the bed and they just immediately notice that we're there. Interesting. Very interesting. All right. We'll do this this way. Oh, you know, oh, you know what? I got an idea. It's not as exciting as I like, ah, I like made it out to be just now, but just pretend it's pretty cool and that I'm super smart, please. Hey, dumbass. Maybe you should link them before you do the cool thing. That would be, that would make it even cooler, right? I, yeah, I know. I'm an idiot. But this is going to be awesome. Maybe. Or not. We'll see. Pro probably not. Let's be honest. Probably not. But I feel like the potential to be cool is there. Ha ha ha. Awesome. Well, moderately awesome. All right, what bone charm is this? Robust. Well, I'm not fat. I'm robust. Egglixers restore slightly more health. Man, I really wish there was something in here to give. There, there was more mana bone charms. Uh, one thing I had considered was... Because here's another thing, and I meant to test this, but I couldn't find anybody still alive uh, when I was thinking about it. So this one I think I might have misread. Far Reach and Blink consume no mana if used within a second of assassination. I think I read that backwards. I was thinking I could use Far Reach and then kill the person, like, you know, while they're being pulled towards me within a second and get the mana back. I think it's backwards. I think you have to assassinate and then use Far Reach or Blink. That makes sense because it's, I mean, they both make sense, but it makes sense as in that regard in that you assassinate somebody and then you use Far Reach very quickly to, to get away. Right, so, and again, I'm leaving them here because I want them to be found with this body, so I don't take the fucking blame for this shit. That's a really weird bug, though, with the the un the link and unconscious thing, because I can't. The only thing I can think of, because while they're linked, everything is supposed to happen to both, right? And not, and within reason. Not ever, and not everything can work. In fact, I'm actually surprised that the grab works on both of them. Uh, the choke out obviously doesn't work uh, because, well, we've seen it. See, they were sleep darting people. They apparently put like sleep shit in this person's thing and then perform some crazy ritual. What the fuck is going on in this place? Seriously, some crazy ass shit. It sounds like uh, Emily parties. It's up here. Okay, that's just uh, outside. Nice, but. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, so 
I think what maybe is happening is because the other thing is that one time we did it. He's just hanging out in the piano. He's he's a card. Uh, the other thing is, um, hold on, God damn it, I get distracted so easily. Oh, let me let me let me sort my thoughts here real fast. Because the other thing is that last time one person was unconscious and the other person died. Now, obviously, if one person dies, they should both die. The only exception to that I can think of is that one of them, they both went unconscious, but then like a split second after it went unconscious, they died and then they disappeared. That's the only thing I can think of as to, to what was happening there. Like, so for some reason they're going unconscious and then w at least one of them is dying like instantly. Uh, I don't think we looked at the bar. Oh no, we definitely didn't. Hell yeah. What kind of a barkeeper just leaves all the money on the table? Ridiculous. Patience of plenty for Hypatia's return. For a piece of welcome news, dark speculation, endless rumors about the Ground Palace. Uh, Confide that she suffered a, suffered of late from exhausted derangement, which kept her from medical duties. I don't know if I'd have went that, into that much detail, but whatever. Now on her way to full recovery, she sends word that she's temporarily working away from Edermeyer. She will give free consultation to anyone in need. Appointments can be made at the Office of the Miners Family Committee. Hmm. See, and I don't even know if that uh, Miners Family Committee would have even been around if we would not have chose to do what with with um, Stilton what we did. I'm not sure on that though. I feel like that part of that being a formed or even being significant was him being alive. But maybe they had it before that. I don't know. I heard somebody shit in their pants. Oh hell yeah. To be fair, there actually might have been a bartender here at some point. And he, you know, fell down. I got this smoke hanging in the air to be like, this is a bar, by the way. Look at the smoke. You know it's a bar. All right, verify. No more runes. Okay. Uh, gonna poke around a little bit more. See if I can't find any other uh, little sweet things. And I will see you guys, and we're gonna wrap this up here real soon, I imagine. All right, let's go ahead and get out of here. Uh, I also remembered, I finally remembered to go back and get that plate that the automatron thing dropped. I think I've grabbed all of those. I feel like I might have missed one or two. Don't think I did that. There. Now to wait. Uh. Yeah, something's gonna happen. Yep, there's nobody on the. Okay, never mind. Oh, you're gonna make me come out there? All right, fine. Oh god, something ain't right. What signal did I light, by the way? By the way, I don't doubt that I've probably missed at least one thing, and it's definitely 100% not going to drive me batshit insane. Just to clarify. Hello. So, is that it? The fall of Karnak? Not the Take fall. God, dead. you're so Long negative. Whatever comes next. Back to the dreadful whale, then, and on toward Dunwall. Yes, at long last. To take back the throne and find a way to save my father. Ready, then? Take me back the ship let's set out all right as you want one other thing i forgot to do this video is to use the heart on a person ah shit i should have used it on her fuck uh, i want to use the heart on people to see what delilah says about the people that i'm pointing at that could be interesting i definitely want to use it on our little allies to see what she says uh let's see there's no way that was six hours it's probably way more than that uh, wow, 64 total. Nice numbers. Only five civilians killed. Not too not too bad. Zero alarms. You're damn right about that. Tons of detections. Holy shit. Runes, painting. God damn it, we missed a fucking painting. 
but I'm all right with that. I'm not all right with that at all. Fuck. Uh, oh well. That's okay. That's okay. We're not doing a completionist run. It's fine. It's fucking fine. God damn it! I missed the painting. Fuck. That's fine. It's fine. It's everything's fine. God damn it. Oh shit. Anyway, uh, meant to end it there. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks again to Gage for your continued support on Patreon. I very much appreciate it. We are on to the final chapter. So uh, yeah, about you know ten more videos and we'll be done. But anyway, thank you guys for sticking around. Make sure you leave your comments, positive and negative, in the the uh, comment section below, and I'll see you next time.